Hey everyone, it's Ivan, KitBadger.com, out here for another review, and today, talking boots, these guys right here, which are the Outlander by the Limbs. So, if you are unfamiliar with Limbs, they make minimalist shoes. I've reviewed a bunch of them before. And so, this is kind of their answer to a all-season waterproof boot, but maintaining kind of those important things with respect to minimalist footwear, namely being really wide toe box comparatively to like normal shoes also zero drop and yeah those are kind of the high points after that they're like okay cool how can we make kind of a all four season shoe that will also do good in like snow and wet weather they were able to do it with materials so the outside being leather as well as nylon and the inside polyester and a waterproof membrane to include basically a gusseted tongue. So the tongue goes all the way up to there, which is, that's how high your waterproofing is, which is important when you're stepping in puddles, wet, soggy stuff, or for that matter, snow. And then of course, pretty aggressive lugs. I wanna say they're like four millimeter lugs. So if you're trekking through snow or mud, things like that, they do a pretty good job. And all the while, again, still pretty minimalist as far as not being super rigid like you have a two by four on your foot. And in addition to that, of course, being minimalist, you have that wide toe box, which is nice. So how have I actually used these? I've worn these on a number of adventures to include backpacking up to the top of Strawberry Mountain this spring when there was most certainly snow. There wasn't so much snow that there was snow at the base to where, oh, thanks for helping. Snow at the base to where I needed to like wear snowshoes, in which case would not have worn these, would have worn something different. But I knew probably the top quarter or so there was gonna be snow. And so these actually did, they did a good job for me. There was definitely mud on the way up. Again, performed well and overall just carrying a pack under load. They, uh, they worked out well. And in the snow, probably, again, snow is one of those tricky things where, hey, do you have like two inches of snow or do you have like two and a half feet of snow? And then with that, what kind of snow? Is it real hard crust where you can walk on top of it or is it soft, at which point you would need gaiters? Otherwise, you would get snow in the top. But I didn't run into issues necessarily with getting snow in, in part because it was pretty hard. Like, it was pretty packed. And, yeah, still had enough tread. And then, yeah, also warm different places. On the range, around town, doing all kinds of things. And then, of course, hiking myself up here today with this guy, Peanut. And they did well. I'm really glad Limbs actually made a waterproof minimalist boot. Living up in North Idaho, we definitely have seasons that are wet and we have seasons that are snowy and this can function in them. 
Is it insulated? It is not. Is it really warm? Not necessarily. So, I mean, I don't know that I want to spend a ton of time in freezing temperatures in the snow in these, but being able to go around town and stuff like that, not get your feet wet or freezing because you're spending this extended period of time outside, I'm like, yeah, they do a great job. Or even just kind of, yeah, those rainy seasons, whether it's spring, fall, things like that. And the other thing I do like is, yeah, just maintaining that minimalist kind of wide natural foot shape, which is hard to find, especially in something waterproof. In my use, have I ran into anything I don't care for? Well, I will say the laces are too short. I can't, I can't actually use these top grommets on here. Like, I, I don't know. I'd probably break my foot if I got this tight enough to give me enough lace up top to get through there and then actually have anything left over to actually tie the shoes. So hopefully that will be addressed. Laces are a little too short. Past that, um, I don't know. Like, I think they're a really good looking shoe, like light boot. Are they, I don't know. They are waterproof, so that cuts both ways. These are not like super breathable. So if it's warm, not the shoe of choice, but again, it wasn't made for that. It's made for wet and snow, which to that end, it actually does a really good job. As a side note, I think all the mosquitoes just came out, but if you're looking for a minimalist waterproof boot, I would give these guys a hard look. They're pretty cool. You can get them through limbs directly through their site. There'll be a link down below. Price-wise, you're looking at, I think usually around 190 bucks, but you can actually get really good deals on them because they'll have sales throughout the year. And especially if you get them in the off season, you can get a really good deal on them. But yeah, they've definitely served me well. And as I mentioned, links down below. Last but not least, if you appreciate my content and want to support it, greatly appreciate it. One of the ways is supporting me directly through Patreon. It helps me go out, create more content for you, as well as gives you early access to videos and we have active Discord. So if you have questions for me, happy to answer them over there. But as always, thanks for joining us at kitbatcher.com. Look forward to seeing you next time.